would say I'm happier. I mean, it doesn't mean I don't get sad. I, I definitely get sad a lot, and I get lonely and I get anxious. And with most people, I suppose. Well, yeah, absolutely. But what's different now is I don't over-identify with any of those states. Um, I know they're going to change. I know they're going to pass on. And, and even just knowing that and relating to those mental states in that kind of way means they will move. They'll move quicker, even. Whereas before, if I got lonely or anxious or sad. I just say, I'm a sad person, I'm a lonely person, I'm an anxious person, and that is the way I am, mm -hmm. um, which isn't true. Not a huge amount has changed. My job wasn't particularly you know, stressful, wasn't particularly uh, unethical, so there was no sort of real issues with that. Um, so, yeah, that was fine, but I can't, kind of in, on an interior sense, an awful lot has changed. How I relate, I don't invest so much into my career. Um, I don't invest so much of myself into my romantic relationships. Um, I invest a lot more in, in something much bigger than those. So those things don't have to kind of be pushed out of your life. It's just how I relate to them is less neurotic than I used to kind of think, this is the most important thing in my life, my career. I have to make something out of this. And, you know, your career just can't make you that happy. It can't, it can't sustain you like that.